Hey guys, and welcome back to some more Nightmare Tower. So, what the hell were we, we were trying to upgrade something, but I just don't remember. I just don't remember, so I'm just gonna continue just playing. <laughs> so, I am still using my uh, my other Xbox controller. Both of them are kind of broken, but this one's a little bit better for this particular game, while the other one is better for uh, uh, One Finger Death Punch. So, yeah, this one, uh, the A button, you have to push it down really hard, so while well, the other one, the A button just gets like super stuck, so you know, the A button can get stuck and all of a sudden I'm just attacking, attacking, attacking and falling down and over and over and over again, so I find that this one where I may have to press the A button a little bit harder, but at least I can be more precise with my movements and with my attacks and not just, you know, drop down and die all the freaking time just because well not die, but lose a lot of speed just because of, uh the stupid A button, so for this game I use this controller and for the other one, since uh, One Finger Death Punch you really don't press the A button as much, you only press it to go into different stages, which of course also does hinder me at times, sometimes I'll accidentally go into a stage where I don't want to go into, but at least it's generally okay. Blow up everybody please, because it's getting, oh my god I ran right into that, I ran right into that. I hate projectiles because I always run into them. It's just like, oh, I got this. I'm going to dodge yeah, right into it. It's, it's one of the reasons why I suck at Binding of Isaac. All right, lots of money. I forgot the hell we're upgrading. What were we upgrading? I can get better shoes. Uh, speed boost, that's right. We were going to upgrade the speed boost. All right, so one more run of that. One more run, we should be able to upgrade the speed boost. <coughs> ah, excuse me. So, like I said, I, I, I want to complete, 100% complete this game. Like, purchase all the items, complete all the missions. So, you know, soon I'll probably be upgrading that potion. Probably not anytime soon, you know, but that potion mission has literally been sitting there for I don't even know how long. <laughs> it's literally just been sitting there like, hey, you want to complete this potion mission? Like, meh. Yeah, there's a lot of other... <laughs> Like, I can't kill 25 enemies in that amount of time. <laughs> I just, I just can't, you know, unless I upgrade my potion and allow my potions to stay longer, it's the only way I can do it. But then, it seems like by upgrading my potions, it seems like I'll unlock other potions, therefore decreasing my amount, my times that I will get the haste potion, therefore lowering my chances of even, uh, being able to do that, but uh, definitely does seem like I will need to do that. I would love to get that last sword upgrade because I would love to kill them wizards in like one hit. All right, let's kill these guys. Man, I have not got the level three horn in like forever. I would love to get the level three horn. I would also love to kill these guys a little bit easier too. But I'm not saving up for that sword right now. That would that would require a couple of episodes. A couple of episodes of just saving my money and I don't know I really like spending my money it makes me feel good to know that I'm getting stronger boom down these, these enemies are a lot more difficult two damn it oh god this guy take three I thought they only took two no, the guy with the super combo at me, huh? Oh no. Up, oh, there's the lava. Gonna catch me. Bye, world. <laughs> I'm gonna fight. I got a new record with distance. Right, let's go ahead and go to the shop and uh, upgrade this. Now everything is getting so expensive. <laughs> everything is like, what, 50k plus? I guess I'll upgrade my shoes next, just so that they can be expensive too. So this run, I'll go ahead and use the money to uh, upgrade my shoes. Damn it! Boom! So I upgraded the speed boost, so that should be good. Yep, there you go. Mission complete. So I get 70 boost when I... Kill, I forgot how many enemies it is, but when I kill a nice chunk of enemies, I just boost up by 70, like, just launch me. 
Boom. Plus 70. And I'm just... I'm so fast right now. Like, I'm just... I'm, I'm launching up into space. I wonder if I'll ever save that last princess. Because sometimes it sure doesn't seem like I will. Anytime soon, anyway. <laughs> Gotta kill their mages. The mages are like probably one of the most difficult enemies in here. Oh, I ran right into his tail. That was my bad. Damn, I'm already right up here with Purple Face McGee. Mr. Shooty 3. That was fast. As I say, anybody want to give me some life? Uh, like I said, I got up here fast. No surprise though, that speed boost. I just shoot up. That's all the enemies. I said, ah, oh, this gets so difficult. So many projectiles. Lava catching me. Going to die. Have to just do my best, damn it. <laughs> Survive for. 35 seconds without dashing it in a single launch. Okay. Seems fairly easy. Alright, let me go ahead and just upgrade my shoes. Ooh, look at my new shoes. <laughs> Styling. Helmet still looks like shit. <laughs> uh, but everything else is looking nice and tasty. Uh, I guess I'll go ahead and upgrade oil next so I don't, I don't lose. I can cut through the air faster. Alright, uh... Alright, we can still do another run. We are we are good we are fine on time. Let's go ahead and complete this mission, so. This run won't be as good, of course, because I have to survive 35 seconds without dashing. I shouldn't even get that horn. Um uh, Survive. I will survive 35 seconds. So I could complete the mission and move on. I wonder how many missions there are. That I've been clean, completing as many missions as of late, especially that potion mission. Like, that mission has literally been sitting here since, I'm um, maybe like episode two? <laughs> complete? Yep, complete. Now I can fight. I can dash. I can fight. That wasn't too terrible for not being able to dash. That's what I need to... Eventually, I will get that potion, but everything else just seems way more upgradable. It's just like, why should I upgrade that when I can upgrade everything else? You know? Like, potions are so situational. While all my upgrades are passive, passive upgrades are definitely better. Damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it. <laughs> I messed that up. That was my bad. Ah, fuck these ugly niggas. Look at them. Look at them. They're so ugly. And they take three hits, like, just die. Oh my god, as soon as I kill, I'm about to kill one, another one pops up on screen. I also hate that these guys take, like, a whole bunch of hits as well. Like, these guys are, like, the new bane of my existence. No, 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 no. Oh, fuck it, I'm gonna die anyway, fuck it. I might as well go out like a man. Alright, wait, that mission... I like the total of 35 items. I swear to God, the money that they give you for completing the missions is not much. I need to get that level 3 horn. I have not got that level 3 horn and like, I got it once. And now, and then it was when I did, of course, didn't have the mission. I love how it's when I didn't have the mission. If, I, if it was when I had the mission, then I would already got it done, get her done by now. Boom. Oh my god. That's stupid. I touched it. I didn't I didn't dash into it. I touched it. And then when I was like, okay, I'm going to go ahead and hit the bomb now. I touched it. Then I dashed. That's why I fell. Oh, yes. There it is. I got to kill two of the kings. Or just one. Two. Mission complete, finally. So that one's done. Still gotta get 30 more items. That means just grabbing HP even though I don't need it. Just 
grab everything, every item that pops up, just grab it. Damn, I ran right into that. I don't like these guys. They're assholes. Always use more HP. Kill you. These guys take three hits, don't they? Yeah, they take three hits. Son of a bitch. Damn, I missed them. That was my bad. That was totally my bad. That super laser guy? Yeah, that super skeleton fairy guy. Look at him, he has fucking fairy wings. Hello? Why? Oh, I saved the last princess! Oh, what the hell? Alien princess! Hello? Oh yeah, there is a final boss. Damn, but look at the distance I have to go. Like, I gotta, I'm gonna have to work hella hard to get that. The money is more important than any of these enemies. No! Hey, I got another princess though. Bomb level three. Okay. So if I put use that bomb, pick up with bombs. Okay. As soon as I unlock the third bomb, I saved all of the princesses. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that alien princess. Hello. <laughs> so all the princesses are saved, and now all I have to do is just defeat the boss. Hmm. Uh, yeah, I already said I was gonna upgrade that. Alright. And, yeah, I think that's actually it for this episode. So, we saved all the princesses. Now we just gotta go head up to the boss and take him out as well. Alright. So, up more upgrades, boss to take out, more money, more missions. So, this series is not even close to being over. We saved all the princesses, but the game is not over. Alright, so, I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode of Nightmare Tower. So, thanks for watching, thanks for all the support, and I will see you guys next time with some more Nightmare Tower. Thanks for watching.